Scouting is only for small kids. Well, at least that's what I thought until the year of 2020. That's when COVID came around and changed the world once and for all. Well, it actually changed my life as well because that's when I discovered about scouting and it makes total sense because since the beginning of the movement, youth always stand out in the time of crisis. It offered me the opportunity to be a part of a positive change and I took it. Scouting really leaves a wonderful impact in youth. And I'm not saying this because it's a beautiful word and you like to hear it. I'm saying this because these are facts. And I have seen scouting actually changing lives. I knew people going down through the wrong path in their lives, standing in the wrong side of the law. At some point, they encounter scouting. And today, they are scouting volunteers. If you see the before and after, believe me, you wouldn't recognize them. Well, after one, one year of joining, I have experienced different things in scouting. I have seen children dropping from school. And the only reason is they couldn't provide school supplies. Knowing that education is free in Tunisia, that sounded weird at first, but we succeeded to provide school supplies not once, not twice, but multiple times. I have also witnessed people shaking in the cold of the winter. Today, I can gladly say that we provide around 500 care pack each and every year along with my group. It's incredible, right? Man might wonder how could we do all of this? Well, I will illustrate it for you. So, please join me as we count my steps. So we go one, two, three, four, and five. And this is how big our office is. <laughs> this is where we hold most of our meetings and we store whatever can fit in there. Knowing that we are a group of 275 members, which means basically the number of people in this room. Isn't it incredible? It's a total proof that scouts make the most out of the least. Can you even imagine what can we do if we had the proper resources? It will be magnificent, I can tell. <laughs> well, after one year of joining, I have been recognized as messengers of peace hero along with my group. And I had my very first international experience. And it was even more mind blowing for me. Because, well, I know like scouting is a global organization, but having the chance to actually see it and meet heroes from every corner in this world doing a great work made me really mind blown and inspired. Came back home and said, scouting offers me a platform to amplify youth voices and I'm going to use it. Apply to be a youth representative, which I am today. Youth representative means I get to amplify youth voices from all around the world and make them a part of the decision-making process. It sounds really awesome. <laughs> well, none of this could ever be possible without everyone in this room. For my end words, I have a Tunisian proverb that I want to share with you. It says, one hand don't clap. No one can clap with one hand, right? Word scouting can never do the work and leave the impact that we are actually leaving right now in the world without everyone in this room. So my word to you is to please keep being the other hand to the word scouting so we can all clap together. Thank you.
Thank you.